Hello everybody, my name is Cats Games. Welcome to episode 3 of Shadows of Rose, the Resident Evil Village DLC. Let's already jump into this. This is probably gonna be the worst fucking part of the game. I don't know why, I just have that feeling. Uh, I'm reading a lot. Did it say something important that she had a dialogue right there? Alright, there's a baby thing there. And of course, I got nothing for that. So, we move. Picture of me. Huh? Before I grab that crystal, is there anything here? No? Here? That's not even a thing. The crystal's right there, but there's no way to get it. This is literally gonna be the same as fuck a Resident Evil Village. We gotta cut them open. Okay, so we need a knife. First place I'm going. I just, I don't wanna fight those white fucking cum monsters again. Just please. Introduce something new. <laughs> They're so not fun. Um, whatever that is. Lots of drawings. Locked from the other side, like every fucking door in this game. The stuffed locker, the picture of the bookshelf, the desk covered in stuff. Stuffed locker, the picture on the bookshelf. The desk covered in stuff. Desk covered in stuff. There's bookshelves here. Is there a picture on the bookshelf? 44. 44. Forty four. Wait, where's the third one? Forty four. Oh two. So wait, what what is it again? Stuff locker, so O2. O2 44. And then that's sixty six or sixty nine, I think it's sixty six. O two forty four sixty six. Scissors. Now it's time to get the fuck out of here. However, I have a feeling that's not gonna be that easy. What the hell? Oh, what the fuck? Mannequin hands. Yeah, Pierre Dollar. Put them open. Come on. Is the crystal in here or is my stuff in here? All the baby things here. Why is this monkey talking to me? What? I bet you can find all kinds of places to play with toys. With th with this doll and her friends. Wait. Lucy. Okay, Lucy. Is that Lucy? That is Lucy, I believe, yeah. Okay, we got Lucy. But is she supposed to face that way? I think she is. Now I gotta find the other dolls. There's got to be one here. Uh, 
This is Catherine. These are all scribbled over from what I've seen. Um, what does this say? No one wants to be her friend. What a loser. Poor Catherine. <gasps> um. Bro, that actually put fucking... Oh, bro, that actually gave me goosebumps. I hate shit like that when you just turn around the corner and it's like somebody's standing there. Fucking hell. That's the first the, the first time this game gave me goosebumps, honestly. Alright, we need to get the other dolls. Jimmy's room. I don't have the key for Jimmy's room. Did I go here? Oh, Catherine and Lucy. Okay, hold on. That's the wrong one. <laughs> you idiot cats games. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Red key to Jimmy's room. Alright. I'm still trying to get focused so I don't get scared by those mannequins again. Damn, Jimmy's room is kind of horrid. <laughs> Jimmy, I think you have to get a new room. At least I have my powers, but... What is that gonna do against this fucking doll? Where's he even laughing from? What's in here? Right here! Oh, Scooby! You want some snacks, Scooby? <laughs> God, this is so creepy. I'm gonna go up the ladder and there's gonna be a mannequin right there. Yep. Здорово, как тебя зовут? Мой зовут Ва. This has no name. Who are you, by the way? See ya. So where does this doll go? Okay. Look, I don't like dark stairs, okay? I'm, I'm looking around every corner. Bro, you never know. I think we need one more for this set here. Okay, let's go to the birthday one. Maybe the birthday one is the next one we go to. I'm very uncomfortable, by the way. Yeah, but these don't have names either, but I think I can guess. So, this guy is giving her the present. Then she is... Pointing. Then this bitch... Is playing with the rod. <laughs> You're gonna drop it on her head? No? Oh, another doll. Okay. Now, I'm taking my eyes far away from the screen because there's gonna be another mannequin somewhere. Oh god. There's a lot of scribbles. Up your dollar. Uh, I think this guy. Yeah. Then it's the other girl. There's the blue haired girl. A fucking mannequin, man. And then this girl's watching, I believe. And they're burning. <laughs> this white haired or this blonde girl. On the stakes. So that key's for the breaker. Oh. Hello? Jeez, bros, you're still 
looking for the crystal? Fine. I'll help you out. Just take the elevator to me. Um. I mean, might be upset that I'm helping you, though. Who are you? Okay. Now it's a brace. We cleanse our butt cheeks for what's about to happen next because I have a feeling it's gonna be absolutely fucking terrifying. Let's play statues. I think that's what it said. Uh, it's game over if they catch you. What? Who? Don't look away. Well, I'm fucking... I'm saving. Um, okay, just don't let me... Lord have mercy. Where the fuck do I go? Okay. I'm in the hallway now. Gotta make it to the bedroom. Which is? To my right, I believe. <gasps> oh my god can I still okay let me go like here Can't hide under the bed. Jesus Christ. Oh no. Of a match. Go, 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 go. Is there only two? Please tell me there's only two. Uh, am I going the right way? Go, 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 motherfucker, go, motherfucker, go. Run, motherfucker, run, motherfucker, run. Run, motherfucker, run, motherfucker. Go, go, go. I hate this. Ooh. Go. What? Where's the breaker? This is the breaker. Go. Get the fuck out. Ugh, I hope this thing work. <laughs> oh, that's so terrifying. Holy fuck. You're after the crystal, aren't you? Do you know where it is? <laughs> I've gathered some friends just for you. Entertain them. And maybe I'll tell. Hmm. 
That was 20 minutes of hell. I don't want to ever go through again. Holy shit, I'm small. <laughs> there's a big... There's a huge fucking printer. Let's play hide and seek. Can you make it all the way here without getting caught? I don't want to do this. Fu Please, just no more mannequins. That's all I'm asking. Go to the bedroom. Wait, I'm literally in the same exact area, okay. That was very close. <gasps> what happens now? <laughs> oh. Am I just... Is it just one hit then? You can't fucking see me. Don't fall off. I actually forgot I was blocked off by that. <laughs> I think I go back here. Somewhere. They found me. Fuck, I didn't know they were gonna come at me. Okay, I'm still safe though. However, I literally have no fucking first aid or anything, so. Yikes. Okay, there's gonna be another distraction moment here. Just gotta go get those somehow. Oh, they're all looking here. I don't know their movements. Oh my god. That's gonna be a distraction. And then the last one is up here. That's so gonna be another distraction, I think. I don't know, I'm running. Huh, what is that? Is that gonna be a mannequin? Oh, for fuck's sake. No way. Tell you. 
What? I thought I could just walk past it. What? I thought that was my opening. Okay. We got this. I love me some motherfucking ganj. Oh, Lord. I thought I could walk under that. Yeah, Pierdola. I'm just gonna go. Even though I think I am slower and I actually can't run. Yikes. Please don't look. I'm dead. Yeah, I'm dead. Maybe not. Why the fuck did I get the power up if I can't use my power? Maybe I can. Hold on, I didn't even try, so. Where's this bitch going? Alright, let's see where it goes. What does that do? Because the bedroom's over here. Yeah, the bedroom's right here. Fucking. Uh, can this area please end? I hate this. No one likes Rose. The tensions are free. Hey! She has those crazy. I don't like her either. Don't worry about it. Oh. Bro, I can't imagine this game for someone who, like, is scared of dolls. I'm not really scared of dolls, but but I'm mannequin shit. I just hate being chased, like, something behind you and the sounds. What's happening now? Whatever, I'm running. I gotta get out of here. Escape the dolls. I'm just running. Fuck this. Oh god. Go, 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 go! The mannequin's right there, go. No, it's not Ethan's fault. I finally found you, let's go. Yeah, fuck that mannequin, bro. Fuck it. Do you no, resent him? I, I don't know. I don't know the first thing about him. Damn. I wish I did. They kept a secret from her? He died protecting me. Sometimes I try to imagine what my life would have been like if he hadn't died. But he've taught me to ride a bike, helped me with my homework. Me a story every night. Where's her mother? Would he have been there for me? She was there at the end of village, but I don't know what happened to her. When I feel lost or afraid, I try to imagine what he might have said to me. Come. I have something you should see. We're gonna see Ethan. Thank fuck we're done with that part though. Holy shit. This yeah, is the house.
You're safe here. It feels God, my fucking headphones. Familiar. Like I've been here before. Cause this is your house. This is your crib. Look at all the decorations. Some to do, decorate the living room, done, get wine, put it in, in dining room. Yep. Rolls other okay, present and whatever. I'm so lucky to have you both in my life. What's that voice? Where's Mia? Is that... Dad? This must be my parents' house from when I was a baby. I bet other things also have my dad's memories. Like the wine. My dad used to feed me alcohol when I was a toddler. <laughs> Imagine. Hard to believe one day she'll be old enough to share a bottle of wine with her old man. So dad was a wine drinker. Yeah, he was a raging alcoholic and abusive father. <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> okay, so what I said kind of sounds bad. It, it sounds like I'm saying my dad did this, but like what I'm trying to like, I'm, a, I'm trying to make a joke of the dialogue that like, let's say, Rose goes up to like a bottle of vodka or something and it just it's just Ethan's dialogue about how he's a raging alcoholic and he he doesn't get any pussy from me uh, so he has to fucking drink. <laughs> that's why that's kind of the joke I'm making. She bangs her spoon every time I play this. I wonder if she'll be a musician. I wonder if dad played any instruments. She just cannot get enough of this stuff. I bet dad would feed me as soon as I started crying. This is kind of wholesome, not gonna lie. But I want to see Ethan again. I love Ethan. Let me check one more room. Okay, maybe not. Wait. Take your time and look around. Well, I think the game's giving us a breather after that Rose fucking such part. A picky eater. All she ever wants is fruit puree. I guess I've always loved fruit. Baby food. I wonder how it actually tastes like. I haven't had baby food since I was a baby food. <laughs> what did I just say? Imagine there's one on the toilet and it's like Ethan's like dialogue. It's like I remember I took the fattest shit in my life. I couldn't get off the toilet for this five days. Always been special for our family. I think I've heard this before. It's pretty. I used to actually have one of these kinds of things. I remember. Like you could, like, you wind it up. It wasn't like this old, but it was like a toy or something. It's very cool. What's this? Nothing here. All right, let's go to the crib first. It's growing so fast. Getting bigger every day. This crib is so little. She's already growing out of these onesies? I can't believe I was ever this tiny. We all were, to be honest. Uh, February 2nd is Rose, Rose's half birthday. Half a year in the blink of an eye. I wanted to capture this moment, these feelings, so I wrote something special. I may have gotten a bit sappy, though. I feel embarrassed if anyone stumbles across it, so it's safe in the sideboard for now. Uh, the key is behind my favorite photo. Favorite photo. I wonder if she'll look like me when she grows up. Oh, I looked so happy. And then the key should be here. Haha. -ha. Open this fucking cupboard. God, my ear is irritating me. Cause I have to I have to do this because I can't hear myself otherwise, so. And I need to hear myself. Happy half birthday, Rose. My gift to you is a promise. I'll always be there for you. No matter what. I'll be there every birthday to watch you blow out the candles on your cake. I'll be there to make you breakfast and walk you to school every day. I'll be there when you have a bad dream and sing to you until you fall back asleep. I'll hug you tight when you're troubled or worried and tell you that everything's gonna be all right. You are my precious Rose. Never forget that, Dad. Oh, that's sad. Oh, this bitch again. No. 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 Michael! Michael, help! Michael! No! I thought we killed her in, like, Resident Evil 7. <laughs> Guess what? That 
thing you're looking for? She's really creepy looking. Isn't here. <laughs> so, you don't have the purifying crystal? <laughs> of course not. <laughs> For that, you'll have to go deeper. We're back Not here again? Deeper. Poor Rose. <gasps> she can't trust anyone. <laughs> Why are you doing this? No one loves you. And when you're dead, no one will care! <laughs> Enough game. Never did I want to punch a kid more. Drown. I need to get out of this house. I came first. Ah. First. Eve so Evelyn don't doesn't want us to be alive. You. What are you talking about? Because Miranda wants us, not her. I'm stuck, by the way, because the game did not give me any time. <laughs> okay. I am lost. Well, I tried escaping, but it didn't let me do shit. What are you talking about? What? Am I not supposed to... Okay. I think what I'm supposed to do is break it and then go back instead of going front, which is what I've been doing. I'm probably not the only one that failed at this part, to be honest. Fuck off! You're, you're so annoying. Little fucking kid. Just punch her. Okay, can I actually go here, please? There you go. What's this? White Sage. Oh lord. What the fuck? Leave me alone. Where do you think you I'm going. Oh my god, that's a lot of them. I don't think me looking at them does anything. Uh, they're still coming. Yep. Go away! Women. Punch her, come on. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> I'm something, it said. Be careful. Okay, it said I'm something. We're not safe yet. Evelyn's causing this. Why is she the cause of everything? We still can't get out. Cool. Use your powers on her. I can help when she's weak. Cool. I mean, I'm gonna try. Fight Evelyn. Where's where's this bitch? Yeah, flask. First aids. Come on. Okay, nothing else. Let's go fight her. What else does it say? Don't panic. You got this. I got this. Where is this bitch? Never, never. Shit. This way. I have been such a good girl. What the fuck? I can't fight her. Wait for an opening, it says. There is no fucking opening. Now there is. I'm dead. 
This fucking game! <laughs> to suppress! What am I doing? What the fuck am I doing? I have been such a good girl! That still fucking hits me. Cunt. Now use your powers. What am I doing? I'm right up to her face. Use Rose's powers to suppress Evelyn. What am I doing? I am... Fuck no! How do you want me to fight her? I can't block her shots at all. Oh, I was supposed to hide behind shit, I guess. Now? There you go. Oh shit. Die. We were supposed to be a family. But you're completely obsessed with stupid old Rose. There you go. Die here. Shit. Watch your step. I'm trying. Oh god. If you weren't fucking born, we wouldn't have this fucking mess. Where is she? This is stupid! Oh, she can't reach her, I don't think. Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, shit. Uh, heal. Shit. Well, I gotta go up here anyways, so... You're worthless! Nothing! God damn. No I'm, trying to, I'm trying to get an opening here. Now. Oh, she fucking disappears. Such a little no, cunt. Now. Please tell me that's it. Fuck you, bitch. That took way too long, man. Ethan? Don't oh. Up, Rose. Find that crystal. It was him all along, helping us. How though? She doesn't know how her father looks like, I don't think so. Rose, look out! He... He saved me. But he didn't make it. That voice. My dad's voice. That's your dad. Is Michael... My dad? Don't give up, Rose. Find that crystal. Because of him. I can keep going. Because of him, you were fucking born in the first place, so... I have to find that crystal. 
Her dad, Ethan literally lived in peace for, <laughs> or died in peace, and was probably at I'm peace. On my own. But I have to keep going. How old, how old is she? 15? 16? For like 15 years? He was resting in peace and now he's back in some kind of capacity. More ammo. We're still gonna be fighting stuff. More ammo. We're still gonna be fighting stuff. Oh, I got my shotgun and stuff back. Of course, I have no fucking shotgun ammo. One first aid. There you go. All stocked up now. Where the hell am I? God damn. What is this place? This is the village again? <laughs> Head for the giant core. Who's that? That's me. Oh, Sage, this is why I always fucking look around. First aid here. They're all just like in the castle. <laughs> okay. It seemed easier to kill, though. I'm just gonna ignore them from the hall. If I, if I can. Oh, shit. Kind of trapped in it. Hasta la vista, goodbye. I need to find that crystal. We're going down into the cave. This is where we found Miranda. Search the cave. Let's go. Ew. Bro, I hate shit like that. Like I hate living things like that. Ugh, it's just disgusting. Where those copies of me came from. It's pooped out a human. Someone's been here. Ain't reading all that. <laughs> you can pause the video and read that if you just care about the lore that much. I don't really care. I mean, I love this game, don't get me wrong, and I'm kind of enjoying myself, not gonna lie. I just don't see the point in reading that. I can always watch like a fucking lore video anyways, so. That is so disgusting. Whatever, let's go. There's that feeling again. It's so strong. It must be the crystal. I'll read these small ones, though. Uh, that pool I've been feeling is so close, but I just can't get any further. I thought I had made it when I saw the blue light, but no, not quiet. If only I'd been braver, faster, stronger, so close. I was so close. Michael. Seems to be a lot of copies that actually almost made it. Not, not a single one so far in the cave, though. It's through here. Holy shit, there's a lot of crystals. A uh, black god which lives in us and in which we live create for us a new world as benefits your will, your dark consciousness holds for us a second chance, graciously offered and joyously accepted. Uh, you drink the blood of the lost lamb as it falls upon your darkened earth, not to destroy but to preserve and once again deliver unto life. Yeah, I don't know what the fuck is going on story-wise. There's a lot Something of crystal here. I can feel it. 
Yes, sir. No way you can just grab it and get away with it. gonna pass out no well, it's gone oh my god is this what normal feels like <laughs> um mother miranda okay <laughs> so powerful far too powerful for me to subdue directly so i had to lure you into this realm so that you might willingly relinquish your powers no but Kay said did he or did i that Kay was an illusion very convincing wouldn't you say? No way. Now you can become the vessel for my Eva! Why is the game so quiet for me? <laughs> Rose, run! It is back again! Ethan, you pest! Go! Pest! <laughs> I'm running, I'm running, I'm running. You can't escape! Not okay, hold on, the game's now too loud, way too loud for me. Holy shit. Yes, Ethan, you badass. I just realized my, my webcam the entire time was not centered on me. Fucking hell. That's fine though. <laughs> I didn't want to complicate things. I just needed you safe. And I'm sorry I left you alone. But I had to find a way out. And I did. It's just ahead. I'm running. I'm going. Hello? You can't escape from us. Ethan, persistent as always. Rose, now's your chance. Go live a normal life. Make friends. No one will ever call you a freak again. But... Rose, just go! I don't want to leave you! I know. I love you. But I need to know that you're safe. So please, just... Ethan, you insolent pest! I got this. Get out of here. Oh, poor Ethan. Don't worry, Dad. I've got 
<laughs> oh, I, I just sneezed. Oh shit. Alright, how do I find her? Uh, A, D plus E. Oh, there you go. That's a weird combination. Okay, I just walked right into that one. What would be the point? You can save your father. You are of two different worlds. How dare you? <laughs> there you go. Alt rally Rose's powers into a there massive. Wherever that fucking did. I'm gonna fight her the old school way. You are but a vessel! It took so much to lure you. There's Ethan. But you're incredible. Well, might change your mind when I put an end to your plans. Come! Be by my side! Bitch, die, bitch. Have the power to That is why it must be. You are the only one who can bring her back to Shite. Whatever it takes, whatever I must do, I will this Fuck, I'm almost dead as well. I don't like the way you fucking have to dodge. I thought she said bitch. Wait, how do I defend against this? Hold on. You will never be normal. Only it's... I understand how special you are. It's it, the, the fucking combination to dodge is so shit. You just won't give up. You really are. That's some makes you the perfect best. Fucking hell. You I would have loved some more fucking shotgun ammo, but Have enough fucking time to do that combination. Wait, there's some ammo here. Why do you Because you're a stupid bitch. I'm gonna pick up all the ammo there is, but I think that's all there is, anyways. There you go. It's so hard to do that. Like, it's ridiculous. The hell? There is no victory. How am I supposed to survive that, man? Take her 
Jim. How did he get this power, first of all? Second of all, how did he discover this power that he has? Maybe there's gonna be another DLC. We never know. Let's go, let's kill this bitch. Return and yield your strength to me. So much power. You truly would have been the perfect vessel for my Eva. Is that it? <laughs> Oh, we actually see his face, like his whole entire face for the first time. You're, you're so grown up now. Even though I wasn't there with you, I've always watched over you. I'm so sorry I couldn't protect you. All you've ever done is protect me. No. Not this time. You lost your chance. I'm so sorry. No. It was my choice. And I don't regret it one bit. If I had left you, then we never would have had this chance to talk face to face. <laughs> so it's okay. I'm not crying. <laughs> Where's Mia, though? I'm so very proud of you. I love you, Rose. They're still hiding his face. I love you too, Dad. Back. I'm back. But you still got your powers, though. Ah. Touch the moon is too far away. Wait, what if he has a rocket ship? Uh, okay, then he can touch it, but it'd be very, very cool. This is the cutscene from the end of Village. You were being silly. I don't think. <laughs> week I have a lot of tests coming up you know how it is <laughs> talk of the goddamn devil do 
Nobody calls. I love you. What's her duty? Pause. Yeah, I found her. Where else? The day of all days. We have a situation. You're needed, Evelyn. Don't you ever call me that again. Whoa, whoa, it's just a joke, Rose. I can show you things even Chris doesn't know I can do. We have a clear shot. Stand down. I can handle it. She's just a kid. No way they can take her down with just a bullet. There is literally no way, in my opinion. With her powers, no way. Oh. Are we gonna see the man again? Yep, there's the man. I wonder who that is. Seems they're walking up to the car. Ah, uh, cuts again. I thought they were going to show more. Well, there you go, guys. This has been Cats Games. Thank you guys so much for joining me in this Resident Evil Village journey. I believe there's going to be another DLC in the future. I don't know. I might be spreading misinformation, but... No, I like this. I just wish... I wish the certain moments weren't just very fucking infuriating. I'm left with more questions about the series and whole than resolvement. If that's a word, you know? Like, how did Ethan get his fucking powers? How is he able to do all this shit? It's... Uh, it's just a mess. And where the... Uh, <laughs> most important thing, where is Mia? Thank you guys so much for watching. If there's something after the credits, I'll show. But see you guys next time. Peace.